Hey, good afternoon and welcome. My name is Sandra. My channel is called Sussex Sandra and welcome. How are we all doing? Are we all doing all right? Yeah, we are. Good. Glad to hear it. Okay, so this afternoon I am taking, uh, my, I'm taking my lunch break right now. So I thought, right, good time to unbox my look fantastic box. It just came this morning. So just use some of my lunch breaks just to do this. So it's not going to be a long video because I'm hungry and I want to go and eat. So before I go into my look fantastic um, for October, we're in October already, guys, already. Yikes. Before I go into that, let me go in, let me give you a quick review of how I got on with last month's products. So before I do that, look fantastic. It is a monthly subscription box, beauty box. You get skincare. Occasionally you might get a bit of makeup, but it's usually skincare, hair care and tools or beauty tools, accessories, that sort of thing. It will, if you buy the box, that's a one-off, it's £15. But you can also sign up um, to sort of fixed term contracts with them. So you can get a three month, a six month and 12 month contract with them. And then by signing up, the longer you sign up for, the cheaper the box will be for you each month. So for example, I'm signed up to the six months. So I pay instead of £15 a month, I pay £13.75 a month. If you sign up for 12 months, you'll only pay £13 per month. And if you sign up for, I think it's three months, it's something like £14.50, £14.75 a month. Um, I have heard from a couple of other sort of YouTubers who I watch. So I'm thinking I heard Chantel Ranger mention it. And I'm pretty certain I've heard um, Joelle say it, that the price of the Look Fantastic box is going up. But I haven't received an email. I haven't had any notification about it. And the price I'm paying each month is exactly the same. So I don't know about that. But do look out. The price may be going up soon per box. So, and I wouldn't be surprised because I think everywhere, all subscription boxes right around the world, they're all going up in price. I mean, I can't even tell you about the American beauty boxes. They've gone up so much. I'm actually sort of seriously reconsidering who I'm going to stick with and who I'm going to drop because they've just gone up so much, so much. Um, but I don't think the UK boxes are going to be going up in that same sort of large increments like the American ones. If they go up, it'll be like 50 pence per box or something like that. That's what I think, but I don't know. Let me just go over what I got last month in September. I received six items. And for those of you who are regular viewers to my channel, hi, welcome. You all doing good? Yep. Um, I give a score to the products I receive. So I'll give a score of zero if it's a something that I'm not going to be using, it's not suitable for me, I don't want it, it's a duplicate. I can't see anybody in my sort of close family going to be using it. So I'll give that product a score of zero and chances are I'll probably put the product, depending on what it is, I might put it in my giveaway or I might put it in the beauty bundle or if it's really bad, I might just throw it away. But usually it ends up in something like a giveaway box. I'll give a score of a half to a product if it's something that, okay, I personally won't be using it because I have no need for it, but maybe somebody in my in my family, like my daughter or my sister or you know, my mum, anybody might be using, or it could be a close friend, and might say, oh, right, this is something you might be interested in, and I'll give it to them instead. So I'll give that a score of half if that's the case. I also sometimes give a score of half um, if it's a product that I tried after my first impression and sort of found out you know what I really don't like this hasn't worked for me at all I might drop that score down to a half so you know so that could happen when I do the review after a month and then I'll give a score of one if it's a product that I know I'm going to be using and you know if it's something that um, I've really enjoyed I've really really liked it I might even give it a boosted score of like one and a half so you know so my, my scores usually are zero to one very very rarely do I give a boosted score so last month, first product received was, well, the first two products were a shampoo and conditioner. So it was a bleach reincarnation, it was a bleach reincarnation conditioner and shampoo. Both products are still here because I, I initially gave them a half because I thought maybe my, my daughter might use it. They still remained untouched in my bathroom. So I may just bring them down and put them in my next giveaway instead because no one's using it in my family. So says it all really so they've got a score of zero for both of them 
that's the first two products the third product was from Disciple it was a dreamy skin um, retinol night oil I was really looking forward to using this product because I tried a Disciple sort of serum product a few years ago when I received a box which I think might have been called the Cos box and I received the Disciple skincare products in there at that time really really gorgeous product it was like a serum and it had an almost immediate effect on clearing up my skin even in my skin tone quite expensive i think i can't remember what the product was called it's like dream skin or something it was about 50 quid to buy it um so i was quite interested in trying out this product because i know that it's going to be a quality ingredient so i was i was using it for the first few nights and then what happens i keep my sort of skincare things that i'm i'm using on my sort of dressing table at the side of me so I make sure I use them at night time and somehow or another I was just being clumsy or I was tired I didn't have the bottle I didn't put the dropper in properly so I think I used it and then I somehow knocked it off the nightstand didn't even notice that I knocked it off and it all just drained away into my carpet so all gone all finished so I'm really really disappointed about that so I didn't really get to use it but for a little while that I did use it I did enjoy it so okay, overall I am still going to give it a score of one because no it's not I know it's something I would have enjoyed using I just didn't get to finish it so I'm still going to give it a score of one the next product we got was from Ren, so Ren Beauty Care, and we've got our Ready Steady Go uh, Daily AHA Tonic which is very much like the Pixie Glow Tonic and I've, I've I've been using it. I'm still using it. I'm still using it. I use it. Um, tend to use it in the morning, um, which is weird for me because normally those sort of things. No, I use it at night time. So I tend to use it at night time. So as my toner for night time. Um, and yeah, it's fine. No problems at all. So I'm going to give that a score of one because I'm not having any issues. So it's all good. Next product was a CVD Solar Oil Nail and Cuticle Care. Well, it's just a cuticle oil. It's only a little bottle, but you know, I have I have used it. It's in my little bag of my my cuticle oil. So it, I literally, when I'm looking for a cuticle oil, I'll just grab whatever my hands land on. Um, so I have used it. No problems. It's going to get used. So that gets a score of one as well. And the final product was from Elemis, and it was just a pro collagen um, hydro gel, just a little eye gel mask you put underneath your eyes. Problems with that is something I enjoy using. I think I use it the same night that I got the box actually. So that got a score of one as well. Just be so nice if we could get like three or four, or just like the full packet. But the one is nice. So overall. I initially gave the box in my first impressions I gave it a four and a half and um, this time around it's got a score of of four so four out of six is still good so that's all right and I've got my values worth £13.75 more than happy with that okay let's crack on and let's do the October box let's see what we've got so this is what the box looks like when it arrives and let's tear it open Kind of box this month. So this is the box this month. Okay, thumbnail picture. Okay, there we are. All right, let's go on. Let's see what we got. So we've got a little beauty edit magazine in here. So that'll give us all the information about our products, and there'll be a message from the editor as well that's what the box looks like on the inside so we know okay um so let's have a look and see what they're saying so we've got the title give in to temptation right what they're going to tempt me with so editor's note here at look fantastic beauty box we're all about bringing you small moments of indulgence with products that lead you to temptation sourcing products that we believe you'll want to try every single month and have fun whilst doing so it's like the temptation when your best friend says, don't look now, but, and you immediately turn around, isn't it? Yeah. And you can't help but turn your head at the flash of a light to see what they're talking about. Well, we want to make you feel like that about your beauty box and strive to make sure that you're always in the know on the hottest and most tempting products out there. That's why this month, that's why this month we wanted to turn up the heat and bring you six must-have products that will leave you feeling tempting on the outside but most importantly on the inside 
This month, this month, our wonderful team have sourced products that will unleash delicate floral aromas into your home to relax and inspire positive energy. Not only this, but you've got a gleaming Luvia highlighter to add to your evening makeup look. Once you've had your evening out, you won't be short of makeup wipes ever, literally. We're bringing you the eco-friendly and re reusable magnet. You know what, I'm going to stop reading. They're telling me about the products we're going to get. So I already know we've got a magnetone wipe. So here we go, it's first thing on the box. I've, I've had so many of these. And you know what, I haven't really been using these ones. When I receive them, I don't use them. I don't know why. Um, but I, yeah, I haven't been using them at all. So you get two of these. And with, with these, literally all you do, you just use them like cotton pads. So you can put your cleanser on there, you can, um, and clean your face you can put your toners on there and do that you can even apply your serums in there they say you can even just add water and it'll take your makeup off but I always say dampen it put your cleanser on it and wipe your makeup off and then when you finish with them you know you get two uses just put them in the wash and you can use them again so they are very very handy so that's fine as a first product um, yeah that's not high level temptation there because it's something I've received before um, oh, do they give any prices? I don't think they give prices, do they, in here? I can't remember. Right, so, do they say anything about it? Yeah, so with the Magnetone wipes, oh, they are giving prices. So, Magnetone wipes, eco-friendly cleansing pads, worth £8. Um... In the picture here, they've got the bamboo wipes, which are slightly different from these ones. Um, and the, this that's a box of six. That's worth eight pounds. Obviously, this is two. So, yeah. So, you know, what is that? One pound something this is worth. Okay. All right. Um, next, we've got this. This is, oh, I've received this before many times before so this is paradox moisture conditioner and it's an apres shampoo oh no this is the conditioner i haven't received this one so often i've received a three-in-one leave-in conditioner um, but the paradox products are good that that i have no issues with them at all so we've got another hair product so it's moisture conditioner from paradox and what does it say here let's have a look so we are Paradox Moisture Conditioner. This is worth ten pound fifty. I mean, this will this will be a decentish conditioner. You know, something you can leave in your hair for sort of like ten minutes or so. This will be fine. So yeah, ten pound fifty. This is not full size. The full size they're saying they've given a QR code so you can buy the full size from their website. So there you go. So that's all right, product. It will get used. Um, it will get used. Yeah. Next, what's this? This is oh, this is those brush cleaner things. I don't know about these, you know. But at least it's a bigger bottle because the one I received last time was very, very small. So this is from Isoclean, and um, Isoclean makeup brush cleaner, 110 mils. This is worth eight pounds. Um, and that's it, it's just a brush cleaner. So I tend to, when I brush clean my brushes, I tend to buy these sort of soap pads you can get. Um, and so you just sort of wet your brush, use a soap pad, and then you can scrub it against a sort of like a rubber mat sort of thing, like a scouring thing. That's what I tend to do. The one I'm using at the moment, which works perfectly fine for me, is the one from Revolution. And that's what I like to use just to clean my brushes. So, I mean, I'll give this a go. And see how I get on with it. See how it compares to the um, the sort of soap thing, which I like to use. Because I mean, that only costs four or five pounds. The one from Revolution, and it works fine and it lasts a really long time. The one I've got, as you no, know, I've been using it for a good six months at least. So it'll probably last me a year that one block. So be interested to see how this compares, and it's more expensive. But you no, know, I'll try it out. See how good it is. So it's all right. It's all right. So, next we've got this, so we've got a little sample of something. Okay, so this looks like it's a highlighter or an eyeshadow. So this is the one they're talking about from Luvia and it's a highlighter and they're saying it's worth 10 99 um, Yeah, that's it, that's all they say about it, let's have a look. Probably not something I'm going to keep to be honest. I mean the colour's nice. 
it's a, it's more of a deeper golden colour, so it's a nice colour, but I'm I'm not gonna keep it. I tend to with my highlighters, I like them actually in proper cases or in a palette. When they're like this, I tend not to reach for them because it's just not convenient. So yeah, but it's a nice enough colour. It's a colour that I would wear, but I'm I'm not gonna keep it, so that's fine, let's put that back in here. That'll probably be added to my next giveaway as well. And then what we got here. So this is from this is from Corez, okay. And this is a night brightening sleeping facial. Okay. Um, so we've got wild rose sleeping facial night cream. We've got 20 mils, and they're saying this size is worth £14.50. Oh really? Okay. So it's vitamin, it's got vitamin super C in there, so it's got vitamin C. Um and it's got a so and it will brighten and plump your skin okay i mean i like Corez anyway as a brand sleeping facial so is it like a mask or something oh that's so small i can't read what it says um you know what i'm going to go onto the website and see what it says about it okay so the full size of this is uh Full size of this is 40 mils and we've got 20 mils here. It's called the Corez Apothecary Wild Rose Night Brightening Sleeping Facial. Full size is £29. This one we've got here is £14.50. And it's um Wild Rose Night Brightening Sleeping Facial Serum 40 mils. will nourish your skin during sleep and update your skincare regime with this brightening face cream from Corez. It's boasting nourishing extracts of vitamin C and aromatic wild rose to create brighter, smoother and plumper looking skin by the morning. So and it's a moisturizer. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. And We've got one more product here. Oh, I've got this already. I've got one of these. So this is just a room fragrance, isn't it? Yeah, it's just from Rituals. No one like Rituals. So we have got here. Oh, so we could have had a choice. You could have had a Rituals um, of Secura perfume interior. So it's a room fragrance. And I've got one of these already, um, which I use. And it's nice. It's a nice enough fragrance. And or you could have got the scented candle. I would have liked the candle, to be honest. But there you go. Baker's Carpet Chooses and all that. So, yeah, by same fragrance, Ritual of Secura. The scented candle is a small one. So it's going to be more like a votive. Um, it's worth £5.50. And this is 50 mils. And it's worth five pound but it does it does smell rather nice so i've got one of these already as i said so yeah it's a nice variety of products seven items yeah is it seven items yeah seven items oh no six items so with the iso clean you could have got the brush cleaner or you could have got the sponge cleaner i've got the brush cleaner which i'm glad because i wouldn't have wanted the sponge cleaner so there we go. So just in summary, I've got a room fragrance. I've got one of these already. It smells nice. It will get used. So that's nice. So I will give that a one because it will get used. The um, night serum, I'm not sure if I am going to use. I really don't know. So for now, I'm going to give that a half because I don't know. So we're on one and a half. We've got the brush cleaner. I'm going to give it a go, see if it's any good. So for now, I'll give it a one. So that's two and a half. The conditioner, moisture conditioner, not sure if I'll be using it, but it will get used in the household. So I'm going to say half. So we're on three, two and a half. We've got the magnetone wipeouts, and these will get used. So we'll say three for that. And we'll, yeah, we'll give that a score. So what am, I on? what am I on? Three, aren't I? I'm on three. And then we've got this highlighter, which I'm not going to be using. I'm going to give this away. So I'm going to give a zero to that. So I think my total score is, at the moment, three out of six. Um, I will let you know how I get on with the products, what ends up, what happens to all the products in my next month's video. So there you go. That's my look fantastic for October. It's a nice variety of products again. And now £13.75. I, you know, I've got my value. It's nice to, to receive all these little treats because it's a nice variety of products. Skincare, makeup, hair care, and tools and accessories. All useful. You no. Know. 
Um, it's not their fault that I'm a, I'm a bit of an addict when it comes to beauty boxes, so a lot of the products I've received before. But I think that's a nice range of products, so that's all good. Um, just to let you know that I have announced the winner of my giveaway, which I did in September. So I did the video which, has, which went up this morning, and the winner was Corinne l korean l so she won my giveaway just waiting for her to get in touch um hopefully so i can post it out by saturday so we did get a winner i will be doing another giveaway at some point but i'm just waiting to build up my new basket of products for a giveaway so i'm not saying it's going to be a monthly giveaway for now it's just going to be as and when i've got enough products to fill up a box and then i'll do a giveaway Alright guys, thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please don't forget to give me a thumbs up down below. And if you haven't done so already, press that subscribe button. Do a girl a favour, press the button. You'll see that it's red at the moment. Once you've pressed it, it will go grey. Or is that the other way around? I can't remember. But it will change colour just to make sure that you're subscribed. And you know, if you want to join any of my future giveaways, go to your settings and change your settings to public so I can see that you're a subscriber. So when you leave a comment down below, I can tap on your name and I can see that you are a subscriber to my channel because it will say public subscriber. All right. Take care, guys. Have a good, have a good time until I see you next. All right. Bye.